Increasing numbers of people are being affected by crises in urban areas. But up until now, international humanitarian agencies have struggled to adapt their commonly used methods to the expanding urban environment. There is a need to learn from previous urban interventions and work in ways that don't just adapt existing methodologies but embrace the complexity of the city. The Norwegian Refugee Council learned valuable lessons when they took a different approach in their urban program in Baghdad. These key lessons demonstrate the need for a shift in approach. Working in urban areas is much more complicated than in rural settings and it requires working at many scales. For example, shelter interventions might take place at household, neighbourhood, district, city and national levels. In order to decide how to do this, humanitarian agencies need to ask questions about how they can complement and support a city's own recovery pathways across multiple scales. Analysis is key. Only through mapping the stakeholders and institutions, policy and legal frameworks and history and culture of a city will it be possible to begin to understand how to navigate a route through. Good analysis forms the basis for strategic programs by identifying different entry points and activities that will ensure the most effective assistance. Tackling problems from multiple entry points and with different stakeholders at different scales enables activities to support and build on each other and increases the likelihood of success. Using their core skills, humanitarian agencies can build capacity and empower communities so that even short-term projects have long-lasting effects. Humanitarian agencies can establish and reinforce relationships between communities, service providers or local authorities that remain even once they have left. While a focus on analysis and relationship building might seem like the long way around, embracing a different type of thinking that recognises and works with existing systems enables people affected by crisis to achieve longer-lasting change. For guidance on how you can initiate longer-lasting change through your next urban project, visit www.nrc.no to download Lessons from Baghdad.